Oh, oh, this kid's tortured for life. In today's video, I finally got my mom back on the channel. Today, we're watching Attack on Titan Episode 1 for her first ever reaction. And I'm excited to see what you think about this. It's been, it's been it's a minute. It's been a while. I'm excited. I'm back. It's, it's been like about a month. And I remember you watched all of the Attack on Titan openings and maybe the endings. I kind of forgot. It's been a while. It's been a while. And you said you loved Attack on Titan, just like the visuals and everything. And you want to know what what's going on. There are a lot of comments that have been wanting her to react to Attack on Titan. So I'm going to pop up some in the comments right here. Shout out you guys. Because of you guys, we are filming this video today. All and right. I think it's going to be good. I think it will be good too. I'm excited to just see what they have to offer. So do you have any expectations? Okay, since this is the first video, before you go into it, Attack on Titan, what do you think the show is about? Well, obviously they're attacking something. So I think it's somebody, mm -hmm. a tribe, a group. Okay. That's going to try to overtake. Okay. Maybe a community. I mean, you have seen like giant monsters and stuff in the opening. So you do know that there's like these crazy like beings or something that might be in it. Attack on Titan's really good. It just ended too. So. No, I'm happy because I've never really seen it like a whole episode. I've only yeah. seen bits and pieces. So yeah. this will be nice to see a whole episode. If this video gets 25 likes, we'll continue making this series and I don't know, maybe go all the way through. It depends on how the views are going and if you guys are enjoying like. the reactions. Make sure you like the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel as well. If you aren't subscribed yet, hit the bell notification, be notified for all of our new videos to come. And also, for those of you who don't know, we are doing a giveaway at a thousand subscribers for this Tanjiro statue right here. In order to be entered into it, you have to comment on our video, like the video as well, and make sure you subscribe and at a thousand subscribers, we're giving this away to one of you guys. Without further ado, I say, let's get it. Let's watch it. Let's get it. I'm ready. Attack on Titan, episode one. This looks like the calm before the storm. Oh no. Mm-hmm. Oh no. Mm-hmm. Just like that, everything changed. Look how small they are compared to him. At that terrible moment, in our hearts, we knew home was <laughs> They look terrified. <laughs> oh, they're horrified. I mean, if you saw something that massive walk up to your home, I mean, I don't know what I would do. Shit. <laughs> so these are the people that are trying to attack that thing, right? So these are the guys that go out into the forest and they're trying to explore the world. They're okay. trying to find like new ground to go and maybe build upon and everything. And they go and kind of like take down some of these giant uh, walking things. Oh, is this like the Walking Dead? In a way, actually, yeah. Because <laughs> they're like out, you know. It, it has similar feelings to the Walking Dead. I will yeah, say yeah, that. Yeah. It's a, a little bit different. Because they, but... they always used to send people out of the compound to try yeah. to, yeah. you know, get the lowdown on what's going yeah. on. and. My God, what is that thing? It looks like a... That thing is evil. Oh. Yeah, something's encroaching on their territory. They don't mm -hmm. know what's going on. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to find out. Yep. So, episode one. To you in 2,000 years. And the fall of Shiganenshina. Shiganenshina. I still don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah. To this day. Oh, look how pretty these flowers are. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is not good. Wait, who's that chick? Okay. Was he dreaming of this? Possibly. Oh, yeah. He was dreaming. 
So maybe this hasn't happened yet. He's, uh, he has foreshadowing. Yeah. He knows what's going to go on in the future. Premonitions. Have you been crying? Are those Edelweils? I don't know what that is. Is that a type of flower? Yeah. Might be. Oh my god. These things are naked walking around? Mm hmm Those things are weird. Mm hmm So one thing that I'll tell you, everything that happens in Attack on Titan is important. Always pay attention to everything. So even that little, like, skipping thing has a meaning. You don't find out about it until later, but it has a meaning. <laughs> Is that guy like a guard? Yeah. So he's like, he's like the inner city police, basically. Oh, okay. A little nip. So, so, a little nip. <laughs> a little nip. A little nip. Hey, little nip now and then never hurt anybody. <laughs> So these guys are like the police to keep the peace or whatever, and they're drinking on the job. Jeez. Yeah. This kid looks like he's like a donkey on the edge. A donkey on the edge? Yeah, he looks What pissed. does that mean? He's like stressed out. This kid's stressed out. I mean, Aaron is a jackass. I will say that. Why did they, cut, why'd they tie him up? They didn't tie him up. Dr. Jaeger. So they're talking about Aaron's dad. That's Aaron, that's Mikasa. Oh, is his dad bad? His dad is a doctor. Dr. Jaeger. <laughs> Damn, this kid's tough. <laughs> I like him. He's sparky. He's spicy. He, uh, he does have a short temper. He's gonna deck this dude, man. <laughs> the kids are just walking around, man. Yeah, they're getting uh, firewood for their house. He's just a kid. So basically, they something brings this to mind that this kid's gonna end up being something big because they're be. trying. They're trying to I, make it seem so. I mean, I will say most animes have like the main character is kind of like in the beginning so you get introduced to him they yeah. all have like an important purpose yeah and his dad's a doctor so we already know that's gonna come up yep and there's yep. the bell the liberty looks like the liberty bell mm -hmm. you know kids are always getting in trouble jeez what the heck why don't they just stay at home man these kids Look so do you see, they shouldn't be exploring at this time when these monsters are gonna be running around well so the thing is so like Aaron and Mikasa, they've never seen the outside world. They've only lived inside, like, inside behind that's the walls. That's why he said he felt like a prisoner. Yeah, that's what he was saying. He's like, oh, we are just, like, sheep in, like, a cage or some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, that's yeah. right, though. Yeah. You see, he feels denied. All they do is live in a cage because they, they've they never left the outside world. Oh, my God, that'd be terrible. These are the guys that you saw the intro of. Yeah, they, they were back. trying to save the world, look, but now they're getting killed. Look but it looks them. like they're turning into zombies. <laughs> <laughs> they are. Look at them. I mean, maybe. It's I mean, more, I, it's well, more of a. Yeah. Listen. Moses. He croaked, didn't he? They're going to show her Moses. <laughs> Here's Moses. <gasps> oh, jeez. Is it a baby? What is it? Is it a baby, Moses? <gasps> it's just his arm. Oh, man. His arm. <laughs> oh, I knew the guy croaked, man. You can tell it. <laughs> Well, you can see the expression on all their faces. They've this, lost. This is like, not, they lost. They didn't win. This is not win. good. This is not good. They lost, like, a lot of people. Like, look, the guy has a bandage on his eye and stuff. You see, this is not a good show, man. This is bad. This is bad. This is good. Hey, it, it's action. It's action straight out of the gate. Oh, man. This lady, 
Because he was praying. They should behead this guy. When you're fighting things that of that nature, of that tall and that like strong. What are you going to do? It's, it's out of tough. your control. Yeah. Ass. <laughs> She's kind of cute. I like her. Mika's are, they, cool. are they like you know together? These two? Yeah, you'll see. I'm just. I'm gonna stay quiet. Okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna say anything. I think they're like going out. Okay, so I'll I'll show you here. So this is. These are the walls that they live in. Okay, and there's walls inside the walls. So this is Wall Mario, which is the outside wall, like the furthest out. Wall Rose is the middle wall, and then the very center wall is Wall Cena. So, like, Wall Cena is where, like, the president would live. And then every, like, Wall Rose is kind of, like, where, like, the richer kind of live, but still. Then the low lives are Wall Maria. Yeah. Maria. Yeah. So, like, Aaron and Mikasa, they live in Wall Maria. Oh. So, they live kind of, like, on the outskirts. Yeah, okay, I get you. In the suburbs. I guess, yeah. Oh, and that's that dad's. Mm -hmm. uh, he's the doctor. Mm -hmm. Dr. Yeager and his mom. Yeah, they're nice. What was that for? Oh, they live together? Mm hmm. Are they like sister and brother? Sort of. So the scouts are the guys that go yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, this doctor looks so serious. It's Dr. Yeager. This, if he's a doctor, doesn't he have a lot of money? Shouldn't they live in the inner circle? You see what I'm saying? Well, you need doctors on each wall. Oh, yeah. So he's like the lower doctor. So this is important. Oh, he has the key to the to treasure what? or something. Yup. It. He's gonna show him what's going on. <laughs> that kid's like a rebel. <laughs> the promise. So. Yeah, she's like promising you to take care of him. Yeah. So the Mikasa, her last name is Ackerman. Now Aaron. Aaron's last name is Jaeger. Dr. Jaeger. His mom, Jaeger. Mm -hmm. And then you have uh, Aaron Jaeger. Mikasa, Mikasa Ackerman. So they're not siblings. Oh, yeah, yeah. But they just go out. They live under the same roof. It's almost oh, like yeah, she's may adopted. May maybe she's like a stepchild. She's like a, she's like adopted. In yeah, way. adopted, yeah. But... <laughs> These kids are bullies. Look at them. Yeah. And they, look. That's all it takes. One look, and I'm just that scared. <laughs> they were scared of Mikasa, not Aaron. That's how strong Mikasa is. How could you just live in these walls? This doesn't make sense. Well, you have to think of it. If you go outside the walls, you'll get killed. You'll get killed. So you have to live in the walls. This is like prison. It is. That's what's sad. He's a rebel. 
<laughs> they're not too pleased. Well, look, this is a typical thing of every kid wanting to do something that their parents don't want them to do. It's true. This is typical. What if I turned to you and I said, I want to join the Scouts? I'd say absolutely not. <laughs> no parent's going to want the kids to go out there. Yeah. You might as well escape now because they're coming in. Oh, this is... I just feel like they're leading up to something here. Lightning strike. The lightning strike was so strong that it threw them all up in the air. And it probably cracked the wall. Look. Which means that they're going to get in. See? Oh! These things are mammoth. They're mammoth. And they're skinless! It's skinless. Skinless! It's like, what's his name? That cat. And he got a dumpy, too! <laughs> Beerus. <laughs> That's hairless for Beerus. Oh, Beerus the cat. <laughs> That dude just got crushed. Well, screw being outside the walls now because they're inside the walls. <laughs> <laughs> they're breaking in. And they're naked. That's so weird, man. It is weird. They need to just hide. You hear? His house is in that direction. And his mom's there by herself. He's going to go try to save the mom. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's run into the house. Oh, no. <gasps> they just crush everything because they're Look so big. One. Oh shit! <laughs> oh man! He's trying to be a hero, but he looks like he's Look. inadequate. Ah! <laughs> Look how Look at, creepy Look at that is. guy's face, man. He's like a skeleton. Oh, they just left her there? He's too scared. Oh, this kid's tortured for life. He just oh, ate the, the mom's Watches head Watches his mom die in the first episode. What the heck? Everything changed. Oh, this is not good. Oh, man. Well, I mean, that guy at least got him out of there, but... You know, had he been a real hero, he could have saved the mom, too. And that is why he is a pussy, man. This guy, everybody's going to hate him So now. talk about that, okay? Well, okay. The main character sees his mom die right in front of his eyes. <sighs> Do you think he's going to join the scouts now? Yeah. Probably to have a vengeful spirit. Yeah, because he wants to go fight. He wants to revenge. Mm-hmm. And then the other chick's gonna get mad. She's gonna say, don't do it. But this is the thing. 
it's kind of bittersweet because you know that guy that saved him, that cop guy with the blonde hair, whatever his name was. Mm -hmm. So he's this is kind of a hero, but he's kind of an anti-hero because he should have saved all of them, but instead he only saved two of them. So this is the one thing. But I don't know if he could have, if he tried to fight that thing, it would have killed him anyway. Well, I don't know. Like, this is the one thing, okay, you have to think about. Where did Dr. Jaeger go? Well, I don't Remember, know. he just said, when oh, yeah. I get back, I'm going to yeah, show you he, what's in the he, cellar he that I've been going, working on. He was on. going to work. But you said, I'm going to show you what's in the yeah, cellar the that dad, I've been working on. Yeah, the dad's going dad to leaves. work. Dad leaves. The dad's going to work. The dad leaves. Kids out, causing trouble, and then the mom's Mom there. Dies. So Mom you don't dies. know where you don't know how Dr. Yeager's gonna take all of it. Yeah, but where's how, how, maybe, maybe what he's is he dead to too. Maybe he's dead too. But you don't know. So all you know is Mikasa and Aaron get taken away by Hans? Hannes? I it's been a while, guys. I kind of forgot all the names. But yeah, that's episode one. What did you think? Did it actually surprise you of what happens in episode one of a what you call well, it, a cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's pretty good for a cartoon. I mean, do you, would you let your five-year-old kid watch this? Well, probably not five-year-old, no. Well, what age would you would you say some kid could watch this? Uh, teenagers. Teenagers. Yeah. See, that's what's interesting, okay? Most cartoons are classified as kids, even though this is anime. I get it, okay? What? What about Archer? Uh, well, that is true. That is true. What about SpongeBob? Yeah, but that that's just a kid show. <laughs> SpongeBob's yeah. a kid show. Yeah, but it's kind of wild. You can see the tone of it. But it, it's it violent. Is, this it is violent. Is violent. It's not yeah. really bad it's like, except for it's violent. Yeah, when you think of like it's Archer, violent. like Family Guy, stuff like that, it's very like, it's more mature it, jokes. Yeah, mature audience. This is like straight up like blood gore. Stuff that could like mess you up mentally. I mean, this is bad seeing your mom get the head eaten off. That's what's crazy about it. It, but, but I mean, it's action. It, it gets it's crazy, action. man. It gets crazy. Okay, All so it. this is the deal. I'm going to say this. I like this show because I like action. Yeah. Which, I mean, yeah. I've already, everybody knows that. I like action. I like drama. You know, this is my kind of stuff. I like it. But it is horrifying, though, and it is sad. I mean, it is sad his mom died. I can't even believe that. If you guys would like to see my mom react to episode two, and we keep this series alive, make sure to get this video to 25 likes. And also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't subscribed yet. Drop a comment down below on what we should react to next. And until next time, peace. Next time.